Hello guys, welcome to the Flying Automation channel. Today we are learning here video button version. So in this video we will see the one huge case of video bus automation. That is uh, how to open a PDF file from folder and get some specific data from all the PDF files. So let's go to the UI path and see this huge case. So for time saving I have already created a pro, uh, flow. I will describe you what I am doing uh, done here then we will run this flow and show you the output and how it's work so you can see here I am using the assign activity using assign activity I am uh, taking a path where uh, all the PDF files are available so you can see uh, this is a path where all the PDFs are available and this path I am storing in the one variable is the folder uh, folder path variable and after that, yeah, I have used another activity that is the assign activity. In this activity, um, uh, you can see here, I am creating a new variable that is a file variable, files variable. And in this variable, I am assigning here a directory dot get files. So using this function, I am getting all the files available in this location. So um, you can see the all the expression here uh, directory dot get files folder path so i am uh, providing the path of uh, location so the uh, this path uh, stored in the uh, path uh, folder uh, folder path variable so i am providing the folder path here so now click on the okay so here uh, we have get all the files available in this folder so now we wanted to uh, open all the PDFs and get some specific data in that PDFs so how to open the PDFs here so firstly we uh, will see that how to open all the PDFs so using uh, uh, so as you know uh, we are uh, opening multiple PDFs so we need to use the for each loop so here I'm using the for each activity. Go in, go to the in this activity. Here I'm using the files variable that we stored the, all the files available here, and you can see the current item. So here I'm using the another activity that is a uh, a start process. Using these activities, you can start the uh, any application. So here. We are opening the PDF files. So in this uh, current item uh, variable, I, we have a, a file uh, file name of PDFs. So one by one, all the PDFs open using these activities. Okay. So firstly, in the first loop, opening the first uh, PDF file, and then go to the next activity that is a. Uh, I'm using here the get OCR text activity here so here I am getting uh, uh, in the PDF files a uh, lot of things in the PDF files so sim uh, all the PDF files have a one thing is similar is a name uh, beneficiary name so here I am getting the name of the beneficiaries so using these activities uh, we have a uh, get the name of the beneficiary so here using the uh, OCR so how to uh, do that so using this activity so firstly you need to uh, indicate the element of what you get so suppose that if you want to get the some uh, data so like you, click here uh, indicate on the screen so open the PDF first and click on this uh, tab and indicate what whatever you want to get so using that I am here getting the beneficiary name okay so here uh, I am using the uh, OCR engine is a treasure OCR engine because it's a free if you are using the another uh, uh, engine 
so you need to uh, get the, you need to uh, get api key so we, we don't have a api key so we are using here treasure osia this is not required in this osia not required any api keys so we'll show you how to uh, how to you uh, use this uh, indicate element activity so firstly go to the uh, any open any pdf files so like i'm opening this pdf okay and go to dubai path and click here and click on the indicate here and press F2 and then go to the PDF and you can see again press F2 and cancel this and now you can see you can see whatever you element you want to get you can select and get that element so here you can see all the element capturing in the one uh, sort so i will show you the another case so i'm i'm doing the cancel here okay so i'm closing this pdf and open another pdf that is a this pdf so now i'm going here and in click on the indicator screen you can see now the element is getting so here i am taking the name so whatever you want to get you can uh, get the element of that field and you can use that so i am have I, I have already created the uh, selector for element so i am doing here the cancel okay so using this activity i get uh, getting the these details and after that i am publishing the data in the message box and after that i am closing the application here so firstly i open the uh, pdf file and get the, the data and print the data in the message box and after that we'll close the application so so that's it in this flowchart so now we can run this program and see the output how it's working to so then control s and run the program so firstly i close the pdf now you can see program open the file and it's getting the data chandan kumar so kumar not uh, not capturing correctly because this is a freak uh, ocr tab prakash j reading by the t so it's not correct but getting the data because this OCR is not perfect, more perfect. Amrituja Kumar Pandey. So it's getting correctly. Bikran Singh. It's getting the correctly. So I hope you understand uh, this scenario and this use case. So if you have any doubt, any query, please write your query in the comment section will provide the solution so we'll meet in the next video thanks for watching this video